hello beautiful people and welcome to my channel this is your girl molly mo so uh, to the new people thank you for dropping by and to the old subscribers and to the old viewers i'd like to say thank you for coming and in today's video we are going to talk about the chinese significant numbers numbers that means something in chinese so in today's video i have guests i have my colleague simon she's going to tell us about the numbers that she knows so stay tuned watch and enjoy i'm going to i i hope you are going to learn something new simon is going to tell us okay simon let's go okay now uh, we will know there are many meaningful figures in china for example 666 means very good for example things are done very well and the learning is great for example she or he is good at study so we can see 666 okay uh, so you're uh, saying when someone is going to uh, write their uh, uh, college examinations uh, college entrance examinations you can tell them 666 yeah, yes very good oh okay <laughs> and the uh, next number is rr888 Mm. means you will be rich you will be rich yes, oh so why don't you tell me 888 when you see eight, 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 me Molly. <laughs> <laughs> thank you i'm gonna be rich <laughs> yes. and uh next one uh, 999 means mm. you and your lover or husband will be together forever me and eva are gonna be to yes. together forever yes, thank you. Juju. <laughs> yes. So guys, Jojo is my son. My son was born on sep on nine nine. Oh. So they call him Jojo. It's oh, Chinese. Yes. Nine nine. Oh. Okay. Mm. Um next one is four four four. Mm. It's an unlucky number. That's mm. people you may avoid. Such as buying a house we were avoid the number. Well it's an unlucky number. Four four four. Yes. Is unlucky number. Yes. So you don't want to buy the house four four four. Yes. <laughs> I don't like the number. Okay. And uh, last one is ten. Ten means perfect. It is perfect. Really, yes, perfect. Okay. It is usually used for good wishes. Ten is perfect. Mm, we sometimes send uh, uh, six six yuan, eight uh, eight uh, eight uh, yuan to friends and uh, relatives on uh, holidays. Uh, oh, so so you can send uh your grandma can send you six six yes. six yuan for mm. Hongbao New Year. Yes, on a special day. Oh, or oh, on your birthday. Special day. Let's say birthday. Birthday. Uh, New birthday, Year. New Year. Uh, wedding. Uh, yes. Uh, oh. We can give them uh, Hongbao. Mm. Mm. Okay. So what about uh those double numbers that are uh, on weddings? Uh. Nine nine. Nine nine on wedding. What does it significant? What's the significance of double numbers on the wedding? Um, maybe uh, ten ten is. Uh, or maybe ten ten. ten, ten. Mm. Wife ten, husband ten. Mm, yes. Oh. And we only get married on uh, October. October uh, ten. Yes, October ten. Are you getting married on October 10th? Maybe. <laughs> maybe, maybe. Oh, okay, I see. Okay, thank you so much, Simon, for sharing. So I realized Simon left a lot of numbers, and I went on Google and searched some of the numbers. So they have uh, 250, it means idiot. 886 means goodbye. 520 means I love you. 1314 means forever 2013 means i'll love you forever 555 means a crying noise then 514 means i want to die so they also use these numbers when texting on the different applications so using numbers to communicate and on this article it says the number one one uh, to them means uh, certainty two means easy three means life birth or to do business four means death 
five means uh, no or not six means happiness wealth or continuousness eight is uh, prosperity and nine means long lasting so yeah that's what i found on the internet on google so that was uh, such a, a learning experience like for me i did not know that uh when i first came to china i did not know that uh 666 is a lucky number um because from where i come from and i think from most people around the world 666 is uh not a good number is not a lucky number it's associated with the evil with the dark with the mark of the beast but here in china it's actually a lucky number you imagine your my son my shay is going to write his examination then i tell him 666 so this is the symbol for six in china so i tell him 666 uh so yeah different cultures different societies and different uh, beliefs i hope we have learned something in this video please to the new people subscribe this girl's channel needs to grow so help me grow it help me uh by subscribing it does not cost anything it's totally free totally free just your good heart and you clicking on the subscribe button and i hope to see you on the next video always be there when i upload the next one so click on the notification button okay bye